than I do. And as we claim the streets of England, did this amazing action where 7,000 people spontaneously assembled and took over uh, a highway, uh, a major highway, and actually blocked all the traffic, threw out furniture, laid out sand. There was little kids playing in a sand pit on the highway itself. Dancers came up with giant hoop skirts, and there was a sound system. And uh, when the helicopters came and the police came on mass and finally cleared away the flash mob, uh, all along underneath the hoop skirts, on the stilt walkers, the big jackhammers sticking up the pavement and planting trees. And when the whole mob spontaneously dispersed, there was a neat row of trees planted on the on ramp to the M1 Express. <laughs> <laughs> no, now that's it's so fun to think about that. Um, we're gonna. <laughs> but when you look when you look further back, you look back at there's a, there's been all sorts of libertarian movements like that, and some of them have been a little bit more extreme. This is 1968 in Paris, uh, and when you look at Reclaim the Streets, like they actually they wanted to fight the hegemony of car culture because cars were what was stopping the streets from being art. They quickly realized beyond cars, capitalism itself is the root of the problem. Uh, and here, what you've got is a lot of angry young people saying the whole system is fucking broken. They, this is their motto here is underneath the paving stone, the beach. And so here they actually flip the cars on the street itself, 1968 in Paris, and they've torn out the cobblestones, and they're, they're, they want their streets back. And they're making even the the words behind the street, you know, it invokes that intense kind of action, but also it's, it's a whole concept. Of David Enlake, I'm sure you guys a lot of you have read about the concept of people reclaiming the streets for themselves. So, you know, not going in demanding that there's some big infrastructural changes or a traffic plan or whatever. It's in people's own little ways, with the communities and the neighborhoods, reclaiming the streets for themselves in things as simple as a parking meter party, for example, like ping pong in the streets, you can see there, that just forces a change in priority of how the street works. And not just the angry young students, but anyone who's got kids and old people. And children and families say, yeah, you know what? This is a lot better. In, as one of, the, one of the, if you're taking notes and putting gold capital letters, one of the things to always keep in mind with any action is inclusive. To be inclusive of, of everyone possible, uh, old and young alike. And to try to get people to interact. Not to just be putting on a show, but to, oh, if you're playing ping pong, hey, come on, play ping pong with me. Or, hey, come on, hit a, hit a badminton birdie around in the parking spot for two minutes on your way to work. To try to involve other people once they feel that freedom. <laughs> and they actually come to a picnic in the middle of the street and they say, well, oh, I never thought I'd ever do something like this before. So here's a, an interesting one. This is, uh, this is from Paris, this is the Fatty Plage. And here we look at some of the things that a city like Paris is doing to get the demon of the automobile to sort of keep it at bay. They, didn't, they, don't, they don't want to do the congestion tax, which is in London, they don't, which they're talking about doing in New York. Paris Plage is the road by the Seine is turned into a beach. They pour tons of sand out there. They've got palm trees and showers. And so uh, the car-free street there is it's a, it's a fun thing. It's an artist, it's artistic experiment. It's, it's for making a party. They also have, like Ciclovia, there's certain streets dedicated only to cycling and skating. So on that level, hey, it's a health thing, it's good for fitness. And then they triple the price of parking as well. So they're using a multi-tiered approach to try and keep this, this, this thing in the car at bay. And even though they already have some amazing quality 